I have a narrow AF foot. Hello beautiful people, it's that Korean and welcome back to my channel where I talk about fashion, beauty, and life stuff. And today, I am sharing with you guys my favorite sandals so far for the spring. So I'm saying so far because I have my eye out on a few other sandals, but this is what I have right now and I'm, I'm loving them. I'm wearing them out. So I wanted to share with you guys some really affordable spring sandals. Right, before I get into this video though, I want to let you guys know that I have a narrow AF foot. I'm kind of person, if I have a slide, the slide never fits. But if you have a narrow feet, these shoes are narrow feet friendly. So stay tuned if you have narrow feet. I mean, if you don't, they work too, but I'm just like letting the narrow feet girls now. All right, so I wanna start with these first. I just got them from ASOS and they are these like, they are like a ruching kind of faux leather. They, it feels like it's a stretch, but it doesn't. You just slide your feet in them and surprisingly they fit me. They look like this at the bottom. They're not really cushiony, but they also don't hurt. So they're just a good flat. I wore them with an outfit the other day and I was like, oh, these are really cute. I will be wearing these a lot, so. They were from ASOS, they were a good price. Everything that I'm mentioning will be linked down in the description box below. You already know that, but I had to make sure y'all knew what was up. Second on the ASOS list are these like pillow sandals. This style is super, super, super trendy. I've seen a lot of different like pillow shoe styles. I saw a really, really cute sandal that I was like, wow, this is stunning, but it was like, $300 so this was like $30 so we love to see it but it's that same style as a square toe which is also very trendy and that 90s vibe and they're very comfortable like this cushion that they have on the straps are the same cushion on the sole of the feet so love that love these they're great I am a seven Normally I get a 37 because my feet are so narrow. Sometimes I feel like I need a seven and a half, but I always end up getting a seven just because my feet are narrow. And if I get the next size up, my feet will be slipping and sliding. So if you have that same foot issue, I'm telling you, these are gonna fit you. These and the last pair are gonna fit you like a glove. Moving right along to the square toe are these strappy sandals that I got from Topshop actually like three years ago. And I've worn these bad boys out. They have the square toe. They have the low heel. They're such a 90s bob. And this part of them makes them tighter. Like, I love when shoes have this. People might think it's cheesy. I love this because my ankles are so small and I need to make them tight. But they're just a really comfortable shoe. I wear them whenever I have like the wide leg, like flare style jeans. Or when I want to have on like the long length shorts, I wear these. They're just very, very cute. Mm. Love these. I will link similar styles to this below because I know these probably aren't available anymore. They're like three years old, but a lot of brands sell shoes like these. So I will definitely link some below. One, two, maybe like a girl. This is a very common shoe, but this is one of my favorite shoes. They are the Birkenstock. I got the like gray mauve color. Um, I got them last year this time and I've been wearing these out. They're very cute. They actually go with more outfits than you think. They're like a cool girl, fashion girl shoe. I got these in a size 38, but the good thing about Birkenstocks is this little strap right here, it gets tighter. So if you have narrow feet, these are the best shoes because they get tighter and they actually look more chic than you think, guys. They're not pool everyday shoes. They're actually fashion, okay? These shoes are fashion. So I feel like they are a spring must in your spring shoe wardrobe. I'm telling you, get you any color, but this color actually works with a lot of my neutral outfits. Moving right along to another shoe that just really surprised me are these Dolce Vita. I think they are the Knoll. I will list them below, but this shoe actually comes in so many colors. But let me tell you, they look amazing with everything and they're very, very, very comfortable. To say they don't have a strap around, it's just like a sliding mule. They are super comfortable. I got this snakeskin one, which has like a light orangey, like green hue to it. But honestly, this shoe matches with everything. Browns, blacks, tans, colors. Like it goes with so much. So I'm really glad that I got the snake skin one because it actually pops and it just looks really good with almost every outfit. Like no exaggeration. I'm trying to find the size that I got. Oh, I got a size seven in these and they just fit amazing. I kind of want to get the black ones just because they're such an easy shoe 
or like white or something but very cute i recommend this shoe in any color but the style is cute it would work with pretty much every spring outfit you can think of good shoe i know i said affordable but i had to slide these in there because i just got them the other day and i tried them on with a bunch of outfits and they look amazing so if you want to splurge on a shoe that you can wear a lot and it's semi-affordable it's semi-affordable i would highly highly recommend these gucci rubber slide situations i'm not really sure what they're called but um they look amazing and all the, when i say all the outfits that i wore they look so good in i was like oh this is a movement it's such a 90s shoe it's giving me like old school girlfriends vibes and i just love it i ended up getting the white it's kind of like an off cream white color and it really really lo does look good with a lot of things it's just very cute and they're really comfortable and it's actually tight like i don't need any extra oomph i don't have to put anything in my shoe like it fits me really well so i was very happy about that i had another gucci slide and then i actually returned i wanted to get this like tan shoe i would insert them but i wanted to get the tan version but they're on like back order so i probably won't get them until the summer but in the meantime this she a movement so she's not the cheapest but she's not the most expensive either but i definitely think you'll get your cost per wear if you're looking for a really cute sandal that will match a lot of things so she ain't affordable i know i know but she's she's a good shoe and last but not least again why am i like breaking the rules of this video this is a affordable spring sandal video and i'm adding in gucci slides and tennis shoes but y'all these little shoes are great i've been wearing them out my dog stepped on us so i need to wash them but they're like the veja veja i don't know i've been seeing this little shoe everywhere in different variations but i just got the all white one it kind of has like a tan little outlining around them and they're super super comfortable the back of it is very comfortable so it doesn't like scratch the back of your shoe i actually been wearing them with no socks because i'm that kind of girl and they're great so I got a size seven in these as well. And they just go with a lot of things. Of course, they're just like a simple white shoe. I feel like everybody needs a simple white shoe in their wardrobe, especially for the spring, especially one like this. So again, I know I cheated and said this was an affordable spring sandal haul, but I wanted to share those last two because one, they're very cute. And they go with a lot of things. And two, it's just, it's spring. It's a shoe. I feel like this would be my only time to do a shoe haul. So maybe I'll change the title to just a spring shoe haul. I don't know. And that was it for the spring shoe haul. Thank you so much for watching. If you like any of these shoes, let me know which one's your favorite or if you have your eye out on something. Everything will be in the description box below with all the links and everything. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of me, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I post every Sunday and Wednesday. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.